a way, we still gonna make it. Right. I'm up. Hell yeah, how you feel, bro? Everything good, man. God is good, bro. I feel that. I feel that. God, God is so good, bro. You know what I'm saying? What up, though? Yeah. 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 You got some white teas back there? Laura? I know, all Detroit niggas gotta grab the tea for that job. No, for real though, about bubble. You can't you, you can't go wrong with it. How you feel about a V neck? I ain't really uh, fucking with the V neck, bro. A V neck, the wrong, the wrong man. Man, you don't be wanting like you know, at least show like something. Show something. Uh. <laughs> 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 Let's get it. 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 Let's Hey nigga, fuck around and go spend fast six hundred on the T. <laughs> hood, hood nigga still doing the seven dollar gas station T. Man, I remember that was five back then. You know that was five back then. That shit you was banging in the whip. That's some new shit. This shit called nobody. You feel me? Okay. Shout out that nigga Chris, man. You feel me? Chris made the beat, the maze, and produced that shit. Some Detroit shit. You feel me? Some smooth ass shit. Real simple, real clean. On some Detroit shit. My God. Off the Maurice, you know what I'm saying? We about to go out have some fun tonight, man. Make sure y'all come tap in. Man. You. What exactly is this? Exactly where we at? Right now we on Heidelberg. We on Detroit's east side. You feel me? We in the hood right now. Y'all look around. Y'all can see all type of shit going on. It's the Heidelberg Project. You feel me? Real east side shit. It's like an outside museum. You know what I'm saying? Think of a museum. Literally, it's outside, bro. So everything you looking at around this bitch is trees with paint on them and numbers and clocks, all type of shit. This shit called the Heidelberg Project. Y'all uh, ever come to Detroit, make sure y'all stop through this bitch. Come show my man some love. You feel me? You can't find shit like this everywhere. You know what I'm saying? You can't. You can't. I, I travel a lot. I be all over. Just feel like home, bro. That's where a nigga most comfortable at. You know oh, so this is where you from? Slums. I'm from the east side of Detroit, for sure. Huh? We just come through this bitch. We smoke and we drink. We get our thoughts together. And this this the pregame, man. You feel me? So we go out. You know what I'm saying? We come through this bitch. We meet up through this bitch. We get lit, you know? I feel that. Let me ask you, what was the hardest thing about like like your upbringing, your upcoming? The hardest thing for me growing up, I ain't never really had no big homie or none of that shit, you feel me? So, nigga had to get everything out the mud. Yeah. Like, literally, bro, we ain't, we ain't had no, no, no real role models like that, you feel me? So, a nigga had to fuck up a thousand times in order to learn. But that's just how it go, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. When you out here in these streets, you gotta learn the hard way first. So I feel like, you know, niggas was real immature in the, in the you know, beginning stages of life. We had That's to real. find our way and, That's real. you know, get I to think, where uh, we are today. I think acknowledging it, acknowledging it makes you uh, more of a man, you know? Definitely. Just knowing, just Definitely. knowing where you went wrong at, you know, maybe where you can fix things at, you know? Because yeah, yeah. I'm not gonna lie, like, you know, we all done burnt some bridges, you know what I'm saying? And 
with some people, people that we truly love, even if the bridge is burnt by accident, you know, we deeply wanted that back. You know what I'm saying? But it take a it take a man or a woman to like with like reflect within themselves, point out their own mistakes, not worry about who gave them a mistake, you know, not worry about nobody else's mistake. So just being able to just take initiative, you know? Yeah, for sure. That definitely that's definitely dope right there. But, you know, anybody know anything. I ain't gonna lie to you, bro. I wanted to walk through that bitch some more. But I was kind of scared, bro. Was just... <laughs> They're like some children of the corn shit, you know? Man, I'm about to take you over there right now, man. I'm about to just show you all. I ain't gonna show you all the whole thing. You're gonna have to come back in the day, fam. But right now, we just gonna walk through this bitch. See what's really going on through this bitch. A lot of this shit, you gotta get, get close up to this shit. You feel me? It's murals. It's all type of shit going on right here. It's the motherfucking buggies and shit. You feel me? Nigga took a whole bunch of buggies, stacked these bitches up, and made a collide. You feel me? A buggy collide. So that's what I mean by a lot of people might look at this shit as junk, like an old ass buggy. But then you got people looking at it like, God damn, this art, bro. Who would, who would do some shit like this? Yes. Definitely out of the ordinary. Um, a lot of these shit too, like, when you traveling, when you in Atlanta, when you in Chicago, when you in Cali, when you in Jersey, when you in New York, you ain't gonna find no shit like this. You ain't gonna find the whole block that's literally an art show. You know what I'm saying? Damn. Why the way of going through this bitch type of shit? It's like a little building where they, you know what I'm saying, sorry, a little literature at it. You know what I'm saying? Basically get a little tours and shit out of this bitch, but... Yeah, right now, we on Detroit's east side. We on Heidelberg Street. You feel know I me? Mean? A lot of niggas spooked to come down this bitch, too, man. You know? So, I'm giving y'all some little behind-the-scenes shit. Oh, yeah, this dope. Walk with me right quick. This shit lit as hell across the street. So, you catch all this shit. This nigga got the bathroom cleaners with the helmets on it. That one had a hand on it. Okay, what we got right here? This one all the dots that you see, you know, that signature shit, all the circles and shit on the screen, so all the artwork. Over here, you got this old ass Detroit taxi. <laughs> what's the, like, what's some deep meaning behind this? What inspired all of this? I mean, a lot of people look at it different. It's, it's what you get from it, you know? When I go to the motherfucking suburbs, I feel off. The vibe be off. You know what I'm saying? It, it don't be comfortable. You can't just do what you want to do. You, the police be hiding, just waiting on you. When you in the middle of the motherfucking hood, like right now, we can do whatever the fuck we want to do. It's just a, a comfortable vibe. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's way more mellow. It's way more... See, people perspective on the hood be so fucked up. Oh, motherfuckers gonna rob you in the hood, steal, kill, shoot you. Like, when you really from that bitch, you feel me? It's real love. It's just genuine, bro. It, it just feel better. Like, you can really be yourself and You ain't got shit to worry about. I ain't worried about no police running up on me right now just because I'm smoking a blunt in the middle of the street. Yeah. You feel me? We literally in the middle of the hood. You feel me? But it, it feels so comfortable and so, so good. The vibes just... It's just chill, man. It's a peace of mind. Right now, we on grass in the sand at one of my favorite stores. You know what I'm saying? The liquor store. How y'all doing? I couldn't breathe, man. And I got an eight-year-old. <laughs> <laughs> My eight-year-old do me the same motherfucker way. What you said, boy? Uh, I don't know. Uh, I don't know that. Casamigo. I ain't no good. Don't you. Don't love me, no goddamn car. You better stop talking to my friend like that before I whoop your ass. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Go back to the car now. Uh-oh. Hey. And he know you've been business. Why stores out of town don't be having a small bag of ice? Act like y'all know what the fuck I'm talking about. Everybody needs a small bag of ice. This here right here. This here right here. 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 Right here.
You see the cups. Get the close up of the cups. Yeah, we had cups in our stores, man. It's individuals. Man, the individual cups, bro. Y'all be acting like y'all can't open a pack of cups and give a nigga a cup, bro, with a bottle of liquor, bro. <laughs> hey, you see these loose leaves and the D niggas got loose leaves. She was us. Hi, how are you? Lord Jesus, you looking good like my nephew should. Swear to God. Swear to God. And may God bless us all. We made another day. That's right. Swear to God. If it wasn't for him, swear to God, when nobody be him. Flat out. Flat out. See what I'm saying? Thank you, God. Other than that. Thank you, God. And I wish us all and the best of luck. See what I'm saying? We live a honey to see a honey. Bless that bit. Casamigo bottle. You know what I'm saying? Let's just see for game, bro. This shit is finna be lit, man. You know, CNC TV. CNC TV. We gonna give y'all them real Detroit insight. What you drinking right now, man? Man, it's, a, it's that Casamigos. Reposado. Okay. okay. Despacito. Detroit shit. So you say right now, you about to what? I'm about to, I'm about to take this little shot to the head, man. No facial expression. You, about to just, ah, you know what I'm saying? Just straight face. Like that. Straight face. On three, come on. Three. Baby shot. Straight face. Let's see. Baby shot, though. Dead. First, I filmed it. <laughs> I filmed it. <laughs> oh. Woo! oh, yeah. There it go. Damn. Yeah, nigga. Boy, that shit burn. This ain't like the old Detroit. This shit is way safer. This motherfucking is gentrified. It's really gentrified. You know they done, they got it together though, for real. Downtown Detroit ten years ago, crazy. Bums, crackheads, fiends everywhere, abandoned buildings everywhere. No money at all. Now we got a Gucci store down here. Yeah, Gucci store down here. Mm type of this casino is right here right in front of this you know what i'm saying there's money down here now you feel me so i'm sure it's definitely popping on the, on the downtown side of things We just caught it with the hot dog. We just caught it with the hot 
Shout out to Red Tent. Red Tent, yes sir. Shout out Red Tent. Hey, excuse me, Red Tent. What's up? Two hot dogs. Two hot dogs. Yep, 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 yep. Red Tent, man. Barbecue and Rhythm, uh, Detroit. Collar out, man. You look crazy now. <laughs> <laughs> Appreciate you, I appreciate you. Like, you know what I'm trying to do, man, is spread a little like, you know. Come on, you know, you gotta go through. Woo! Woo! Back to back, Detroit! How y'all doing? Y'all look very pretty. Enjoy yourself, be safe. Yes, ma'am. Lit as hell down here. We turned up. You feel me? Downtown Detroit on the five. I just saw a type of shit going on. Everybody outside, good vibes, good energy. Right here, you feel me? This is the city slicker. This is where they got all the Murray alligators. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? What I got on right now, some Murray's real Detroit shit. You feel me? We on all Detroit shit today. You feel me? See his shirt? He got a lion on his shirt. He got Detroit on his shirt. What's up, man? It's all Detroit shit. We a, we a big ass family. We out family. here. We a big Let's ass go. family. When you from Detroit, it's Detroit versus everybody. Detroit. Detroit's yeah. a fucking bad. Let them know Detroit versus everybody, man. Yeah. Shout out Detroit. Detroit's a fucking bad. Let me ask you a question. Give me one M&M &M fact. One M&M &M fact? Give me one. She live on eight miles out of the fact. Ah, that, that go. That go. Yeah. <laughs> Detroit facts. One Detroit fact is that you go always have a good time in the D, no matter what time of day it is. Woo, shout out that. the city. Hey, shout out to Detroit, baby. Hey, how we doing? We on CSC TV. Bye, y'all. Get one fact about the city from uh, each one of y'all. What's a fact about the city? Man, uh, everybody beef with everybody on my mama. You definitely hey, gonna ask that. Can't listen to nobody music. You can't fuck with nobody, nothing, cause. Everybody beef with somebody. Man. The one thing about Detroit, though, we got the best flow. Everybody trying to come fuck with us, tap in with us. We got the best Detroit. We got the best swag at that. And yeah, we from the East, too. Uh, from the East? Shout out East Side. Slim, Slim 4X on Instagram. The L is a one. on bro. How you doing? What's the word, my boy? May I ask you a question? What's the deal? May I get one fact from you about Detroit? Niggas stand on motherfucking business around this bitch. Ooh. Literally. No cap. Ooh. From All right. East side, west side, southwest, whatever. They stand on business. So. Okay, okay. And my ass, what do you do? As far as like occupation. I rap. I rap. All types of shit. Shout yourself out. Yeah, say less. Say less. Tap in. Okay. Check out that music on YouTube. You feel me? I, that bitch go. No, no, no. You look like a real city nigga, man. Let's get you on the vlog. 
So yeah, we do a vlog for downtown Detroit, Detroit period. You know what I'm saying? We over here on CNC TV. Go on my phone right now. We got uh, we got Instagram, we got YouTube. No, what you want? What I'm gonna see this video on? YouTube right now. You gonna see little snippets over uh, Instagram though. What's your shit? CNC TV. That's Capo, not Capo. Yep, YouTube. Yeah, we going up, man. We down with the city, man. How y'all feeling? Oh, I see you. I'm up. CNC TV. The biggest. It's big all. The biggest. Don't do it. Yo, shout y'all stuff out. Vlog about them. So really, I'm just. So my whole goal is to like spread light on the city. You know, we got a lot of shadows. We got a lot of bad uh, representation. So Look, it's a fun bus. I don't like the name. The name we. We in the wrong spot. Right. But it's a nice bus on the inside. <laughs> and it's her birthday. Look. Get that. Happy birthday to ya. Happy birthday to ya. Everybody here for her. Happy birthday to you. Thank you. Come on. Hey, you I got you. I got you. I got you. I got you. He won it though. All right, now he all good. 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 Okay, that's the city for you too, man. We still gonna blow. Hey, y'all have a good day. Be safe. You too, Brody. I'm born and raised in Southwest Detroit, Big Meats family. Uh, I've been out here, I'm 47, I've been out here doing my shit for, for years and six years, but uh, I became a cook, so I'm doing my shit, you know, but the city is the best place to be at, you hear me? I feel it's the it. The very best place to be at, you know what I'm saying? There's so much love and so If you're doing the right thing, you're going to have the right, you're going to have the right atmosphere. You have to do the right thing first, though. Change makes, makes Change is the best thing that could ever happen in life. You hear me? Over here on CNC uh, TV. I just wanna. <laughs> what you laughing? Why this nigga stay speaking some shit to exist this stuff? Gotta speak that good energy, man. Gotta speak that good energy. I wanna ask y'all. What's one fact about the city that y'all know off the top of your head? Hoes everywhere. You said what? Hoes everywhere. Woo! You can't trust none of these bitches. Woo! <laughs> That's right. That's right, right there. <laughs> All these bitches gone. How y'all doing? Hey, what's up? May I ask y'all? May y'all give me one Detroit fact each? Motor City. Motor City? That's all you gonna say? Yeah. That's all I need to say. It's each. Detroit Fail. Oh, Fago. Everfresh. Everfresh. Yeah. Fago. Okay. Oh, yeah. And we home on the burners, too. Yeah. You know that. Because you remember you said before the show, you should be like, give me some burners. <laughs> 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 you should be like, give me some burners. Well, y'all have a good day. Y'all be safe now. Nah, take care. All right, now, Matt Chris, let me ask you a question. We to ask everybody else. Now, this vlog right here for you. We filming with you today. Let me ask you. Let me get one fact. Let me get a couple about the city from you. About the city of Detroit, even when it ain't a way, you still going to make a way. You feel me? Literally, we turn nothing into something. We hustlers. You feel me? We, we really last of a damn breed. When it comes to our culture, the way we talk, the way we walk, the way we dress, everything is, you feel me, like a heavy Detroit influence from our glasses to our Detroit hats to our coats, our leathers, our gator shoes, our mink coats, like everything on some on some real lavish shit, some player shit, some real Detroit player shit. That's why they say Detroit player, you feel me? Ah. I feel like we one of a kind everywhere we go, and we go everywhere. You from this bitch? You gonna go everywhere because you gotta get up out this bitch. Because the world ain't just Detroit, the world is way bigger than you know what I'm saying? Yeah, facts, facts. It's Detroit, but at the end of the day, when you from here, it, it's culture, it makes it. It's a, who you are, you know what I'm saying? Look at the demographic of the people that's really in the city, you feel me? So it's like dog eat dog in a sense, but at the end of the day, you feel me? If you're doing something, do it, you feel me? Shine hard, go get it, don't let nobody stop me. Keep your grand room, you feel me? Don't never get knocked off your square, never get knocked off your circle, you know what I'm saying? Just keep doing you. And God gonna bless you from there, you feel me? Stay in the right path, stay in the right lane. Everything gonna come back to you like that. That's real, that's, that's how real. That's Detroit nigga move. You feel oh, me? Man. We get money. Shout out Detroit. That's what it is.
So yeah, C4 gang, we spent the day with Chris Cash, founder of uh, Smells of Detroit. Go check him out. Uh, we got a lot of we got a lot of content dropping. We got a lot of films dropping. And uh, so stay tuned for it. Be here, be here, Capo. Be here on CSC TV, man. Capo signing out, man. Y'all be safe, and I love y'all.